a little bit of vlog stuff. Um, yep, yeah, I am currently dismantling an old jacket to salvage the lacy bits on it. It was literally a jacket made up of nothing but these. This is like my scrappy pile. Um, these are all bits that I can use for lace trim or individual little like, appliques, applique type things. Um, this is all I've got left to do. Just this strip. See what I mean? This is what it was like. The whole jacket was made like this. Um, I have done the camera's up there. <laughs> I have done a video showing the jacket before and then blah de blah. Um, but yeah, look, the joys of working with material. I am covered, absolutely covered in bits. And it just gets everywhere. Look at this. Right. I'm not actually recording right now. It's on pause. But look at the state of my phone. Let me just turn the screen off and then you can see. Look at all the dust on that that just kicked up off. It's literally just kind of floated up off while I've up off the jacket while I've been using it. But look, it's absolutely covered. Absolutely covered in it crazy um some of you actually while we're here have asked how do i do my camera setup for when i am filming um actual videos well i've shown it before but i'll show it again there we go guys that's the shelf directly above my desk and it is a clip-on tripod um as you can see Sort of. I can't lift you up there, my shoulders are hurting today. But yeah, and I've just clipped it on the second one up to be able to hang it down. It's resting on there. Um, and yeah, and then that just gets angled how I want it, moved around sort of thing. And it just films like that directly down onto the desk. But yeah, so there you go, guys. There is my um, camera set up. For when I am filming craft related videos. Um, other videos like when I do um, advent in the morning is filmed on this tripod which is one of my old ones and I love it because it's adjustable. It's got a three-way foot on it and this here, I'm gonna get it the right way, <laughs> get it the right way turns and then the whole thing I can't do it now because I'm one-handed but it turns and then the whole thing goes all the way up there and or it goes all the way down there and then obviously this is adjustable and then we have a claw um but yeah so I can't do that one-handed when I film for social Saturdays, you guys balance precariously there. <laughs> like, literally, I will use this camera. Just let me pop it out of here <laughs> without dropping it. Sorry, there we go. <laughs> that wasn't easy. And I generally tend to do actually use this and then you literally, you guys, that gets pushed back a little bit and then you guys literally get balanced on there like so and then I sit here like so and film in selfie mode. <laughs> so yeah, that is basically my very high tech filming setup. <laughs> and yes, after yesterday's tidy up session, as you can see, a few videos in and we're back to a big mess again and um, as I said this morning just off to the right of the camera yesterday that you couldn't see is all that mess which I still haven't tackled I shall tackle that later on when Dana gets here but yeah so you know this is what happens guys <laughs> oh, you know a couple of projects in and yeah Although it's actually still tidy on that end of the desk, so I'm quite happy with that. But yeah, anyway, I'll let you get going. Mm. Afternoon tea. Mince pie. Lancashire parking. Oat cookie. 
with honey. Yum yum. Yeah, afternoon tea. Or in my case, afternoon munchies. Good morning guys. It is nearly long today, 9.49 um, am obviously. Yeah. Sorry if you can hear Taylor. Um, he's in his room upstairs with the door open, screaming it again. Um, yeah, so we're here with Advent Day 12. Halfway there, guys. Well, not halfway to the end of Vlogmas because I'm going right to the very end um, of the month, but halfway to Christmas. Yay! Um, let's see. Not sure what today's footage is going to be like. like vlogmas footage should I say not sure what that's going to entail today because we're back to cleaning today I'm going to finish the rest of my studio off because what you guys didn't see to the right of the camera yesterday uh, yeah really needs doing you saw like three quarters of the room being done the other side that you couldn't see just to the right of the camera is just piled high with stuff um, mainly stuff from out of here from when I moved it all in there to put the Christmas decorations and stuff up moved a few ornaments around that sort of thing just piled it all up on my other um, on the unit in there so that needs sorting now I really need to get that sorted and keep it clear because that's got that's where I used to do my stamping but it's got a work surface on it it's like a kitchen countertop but it's shiny um, so it wipes clean really easy and that's where I was gonna that's where I do all my tea and coffee dyeing but also where I was gonna start doing like messy crafting wet messy crafting like painting and that sort of thing and I want to get my jelly plate out <laughs> um, I want to get my jelly plate out and work on some background prints that I can scan and use for stitch kits um, anyway I need to get that sorted. I do have a mail time video coming up though and it is Genesis Crafts. This is cool. Um, I haven't opened it yet. I've been so restrained. It came yesterday. Um, I have, Like I said, I've been so restrained. I haven't opened it yet. I will do my separate mail time video and then later on you may even see me wearing one of those because they are t-shirts but what's going on them you will have what's what's gone on them should i say you'll have to wait and see um yep today is saturday i am not doing a social saturday today because there's too much to do um also, there isn't really a right lot to report. I'll do one next week. That may be your last one before the new year, but we'll see because there was talk in last week's Social Saturday whether to do one next week. And then the one after that, if I do it, will be Boxing Day. So I may do that one. I, I don't know. Depends how busy we are over Christmas. <laughs> Depends how hungover I am after Christmas Day. <laughs> um... Anyway, I came down this morning to find Snowdrop has roped all the other teddies into a teddy bear's picnic. It's nice to see they're eating healthy though. She's got some lettuce and a strawberry. Drama Llama's got some grapes. Criceratops has got tomatoes and cucumber on toast. The girls have got bread. Um, and then they've got a load of sweetie stuff in the middle to eat afterwards. Not bad. Uh, bread baguettes. That's the word I was thinking of. Baguettes. <laughs> um, still bread. But yeah, it's so strange. So strange. Not coming down uh, coming down and not seeing Elphis here or lurking somewhere doing something he shouldn't be. But, yeah, I should have sent him to Dana's weeks ago. He's been amazing. But yeah, she said he's having loads of fun. Tater Pie's enjoying having two elves because they've got one. Um, that was Elphis's 
surprise, as you will have seen in yesterday's vlog. I knew nothing about that. Um, apparently, my parents got them an Elvis for Christmas, well, Elvis for Christmas last year. Well, Tater Pie. They got Tater Pie one for Christmas last year because he fell in love with ours so much and he's been living on Tate's bed at their house for the last 12 months. He plays with him every day and I didn't even know he'd ex I didn't even know he had one. So that was a surprise for both Elfis and myself when she sent me the pictures. I'm like, whoa, where did he get that from? But yes, apparently he was sent to Tater Pie from my parents last year. So awesome. Um, but yeah, that's really calmed our Elfis down. I was is called Elfis. Theirs is called Elvis. Like Elves is. <laughs> Elvis. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, she's actually resorted to tying a blue ribbon around his hat and then they know who's his, then then they know which is which and who's is who's. Um but yeah, exciting. Um all go at their house, but then again their house is child friendly because of Tater Pie, so our Elfis has been having loads of fun playing with all his toys in the ball pool on his bike, sliding down his slide. He's got a big soft play set um, that we got him for his birthday last year. Uh, no, this year, sorry. His first birthday this year. They were supposed to be going on holiday, but with all the stuff going on, it got cancelled. So she used the money to buy him a big soft play centre set and she kicked her living room out like a like a kid's soft play centre it's brilliant absolutely loves it he's got the slide the towers and all sorts um but yeah so our elfis and their elvis and all their other massive teddies that tater pie has at their house are having a whale of a time um i think elvis our elfis our elfis is in his element there because he's surrounded by other kids his age as well and height should i say instead of little ones like these but anyway, um, he's due to come home today, if he'll come home today, <laughs> or if Tater Pie will let him come home today. Um, hmm. Thankfully, he hasn't seen him as a threat, but I don't know whether he'll let him come home. That's yet to be seen. But yeah, um, and I hear on the grapevine that he's bringing a friend. So it looks like maybe we'll be doing some babysitting for a while. <laughs> but we'll see. Um, but yes, so anyway, she sent a few photos through this morning. Um, but they've not been up long. And she, she said um, when she came down this morning, both her, the Elvis and our Elvis had folded all the washing up for them and you know, while they were in bed, she, they'd folded all their washing up for her and everything. Wish they'd do that here. <laughs> well, I wish I was a do that here. Maybe he might do when he comes home, I don't know. Um, but like she said, um, I've heard on the grapevine from Dana that Elphis has been really good, so he's bringing a friend home with him. I'm hoping, <laughs> fingers crossed, it might not be their Elvis, um, because I don't think Tate would like the fact that he's not there anymore and our elfies will probably turn him to the dark side and they'll have two giant elves to contend with but we will see anyway enough about teddies um yeah let's get to advent because that's why we're here i'm sorry i am in real bad pain today with my shoulder um, um i don't know what my ear is playing at today um it's gone to the right instead of the left normally it goes to the left but today it's decided to go to the right on its own, I've no idea. So it seems really weird looking at myself with my ear the opposite way. But anyway, we are, are here with Advent and I'll go through the usual spiel for those who aren't aware I'm at a slightly different angle today as well. Also, the tripod's higher up. There we go. Um, yeah, for those who aren't aware, my Advent issue comprises. I have no idea what that is. My advent this year, advent calendar this year, comprises of a lot of random things that Mum and Taylor went and bought from Bean and Bargains and then Mum wrapped them up and put random numbers on them and then I sit here and open them on advent every day in order on advent. And today is the 12th, just checking. Yes, today is definitely the 12th. So, 
there's not very many left so things are getting a little bit easier to find number two <laughs> number 12 Oops. the bag's not as full so I can't kick it out of the way now as well um, but yeah let's see what number 12 is um, my t-shirt is reflecting weird on this on the camera it's not a glow in the dark one or anything but it's reflecting okay we're a bit wonky today guys not that it matters. I'm sorry. I'm not with it at all today. I'm just, I'm in a lot of pain with my shoulder this morning. So I try not to talk about it or whine about it very often, but it's really bad today. I'm crying this morning. It's horrible. Couldn't move. Um, but yeah. Oh my God, mother, thank you. See, queen of sellotape. This is why these... I haven't the wrapping papers haven't been getting saved or salvaged you just can't now i wonder what you guys feel when i send you packages because <laughs> i do exactly the same especially if it's going through the mail my post when postman when i go to the post office the guy in the post office the post office that i go to the guy that i see uh, that serves me it all kills my kills himself laughing when i take a parcel in it's like it's taken six years to get in it like, yeah i know but at least it can't be tampered with in the post kind of stems back from years and years ago way before facebook years and years ago well well yeah not before facebook but around the time of facebook as well right at the beginning um, I used to sell things on eBay, just general stuff, like unwanted stuff, rent house, that sort of thing. And it were all about the feedback back then as well, weren't it? Oh my god, what's that? Um, yeah, it were all about feedback and stuff like that then. And I always said, and also then when I started business and everything, I'm like, they will, they can fault my items as much as they want, they'll never ever fault the packaging, except they do because they can't get in it. Oh, it's a stress ball. Spiky flashing ball. Oh, the kids will love that. Yay. <laughs> cool. So it's not that that's been making a noise then. Oh, the cat will love that as well. Never mind the kids. <laughs> yeah. So cool. So cool. Oh, it's definitely a stress ball anyway. Very tactile. But yeah, the cat will love that and so will the kids. So, oh my god, it's flashy, it's doing it. Right. Put it down so it doesn't flash because it's driving me insane. Um, right, guys, that is about it. We have, oh gosh, 13 minutes yet. I don't know what I'm going to do later, footage wise. There may be some, I may, well, I will at some stage get some footage with Dana. Um, because there's no way she'll come and clean and not have me do some footage of her for Vlogmas. Um, she was more excited at the thought of doing Vlogmas this year than I were. In fact, it was partly her that bullied me into doing it. I weren't for doing it. I'm like, there's nothing, there's going to be nothing to film. She's like, you need to do it, Mum, you need to do it, Mum. Fine, fine. Um, but yeah, but it won't be like the other day. The other day was just a kind of last minute desperate attempt at getting some footage because I realised I'm like, oh! <gasps> We've been doing this all day and I haven't even picked the camera up once to do even just some fast forward cleaning or anything and I've no footage at all for today. So she's like, well, let's have a bit of a chit chat then. <laughs> so that's why the start of it sounded a bit staged because it kind of was. Um, but then the rest of it, we just rolled with it, like usual. But yes, yeah, so I will get her on camera and we'll show you Elfies later. Oh yes, we'll do. I'll be back later with a video to show you um, who Elfis is bringing home with him. My gosh, it could be anything from her house. Anything. I hope it's not another giant teddy. God. She's got a massive tiger, a massive bunny. I think, actually, I think there's two massive bunnies. We got one a couple of years ago while she was still pregnant. Um, and then Tate's grandma 
great grammar actually on his dad's side got him a massive bunny oh no that's an elephant no yeah she didn't get him a bunny she got him a massive elephant um but dana's got also she's got a giant blooming dinosaur and all sorts there so i dread to think what she's what friend is fetching home I'm hoping it's something little. <laughs> um, but anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap up here. I'm going to go and um, pop some paracetamol from this blooming shoulder. Um, take my vitamins because I forgot and I'm feeling a bit ugh today. And get some cleaning done. So, yeah, anyway, <laughs> from Snowdrop and the gang and myself. I will bid you all a good evening or a good day if you are just getting up in the other side of the world um, or good afternoon depending where you are anyway yes guys I will see you all again tomorrow for day 13 do, do, do. luckily it's Sunday not Friday but um, anyway guys I will speak to you all again very soon thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the vlogmas footage from earlier on even though this is filmed first thing in the morning, it always gets tagged on to the end. Excuse me, that's why there's a bit of confusion sometimes on... Why is she telling us about that when it's already happened? <laughs> because in my time, it hasn't happened yet. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm just rambling because I need more coffee. It's too early and I'm in too much pain. So I'm going. Thanks for watching, guys. And I hope you tune back in tomorrow. And take care, everybody. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.